What's going on guys? Today, I'm gonna to talk to you about what are some of the benefits of fishing bamboo. Bamboo fly rods have been around since the dawn of fly fishing time. And for some of us, it brings back a unique traditionalist feel and also brings a different vibe and aura about fly fishing. But technically, it also does provide some unique differences when it comes to fishing the rods and reels and line itself. Now, it could be said that we could be fishing just the rod itself on any reel and with any line. But typically, if you're going the traditionalist route, you don't have to, but I typically, along with others, like to go with a click and paw reel, which is specific to a more classic era. And then in addition to that, I like to fish, uh, when available, uh, silk fly lines. And what's cool about that is it definitely provides a very unique casting uh, feel, as well as an experience when you are looking at fly fishing on a traditionalist dry fly or dry dropper rig. Now, why choose a, a bamboo rod? Well, a bamboo rod is typically slower. And what I mean by that is, compared to a modern, faster graphite rod, the casting stroke requires longer for you to wait, as well as typically is a full flex, which flexes deeper into the rod when you cast. So you cast back, and the rod will dampen deeper down into the blank. And when you have a slower casting stroke, it bends the rod deeper, loads the rod deeper, and that often, not always, but will provide a very soft and more delicate, smooth casting experience. Additionally, most bamboo rods are solid. Unlike graphite and unlike fiberglass, new fiberglass, bamboo rods, when they're constructed, are made of small triangles that are glued together into a solid core, and therefore they're heavier, helping to add to the casting weight. So swing weight is a lot heavier than a, than a new modern modulus graphite rod, but with that, you get durability. The problem is, is it craftsmanship and the amount of time it took to make it typically means that you are paying more for the rod. Not always, like this right here is an actually a very affordable rod, uh, but you know, whenever you, whenever you look at um, the, the durability, if you nick this with split shot, not a big deal if you fish it with split shot. If you hit it with on a branch or something when you're casting, not as big of a deal. There are limitations to using a natural organic material but when you're fishing dry flies or whatever, um, I typically will, I enjoy fishing this. Now, you could fish in a very similar experience a fiberglass rod. A fiberglass rod will cast very similarly to this, and modern fiberglass can be fast or slow. So you can choose, and additionally, it's a lot lighter. So fiberglass was an attempt to better uh, form the casting stroke of bamboo, and then from there we have graphite for higher performance rods. So if you're looking for the tip-top performer, this is not it. However, it's a beautiful experience to cast. It is super fun, and I liken it almost to like a traditional longbow or, or recurve in the archery world, where if you harvest an animal with that or you catch a fish with this, it just feels so good and ties you back to your roots uh, or the roots of fly fishing in its originality. So I will be uh, showing you guys maybe a day on the water specifically with this on some small streams here, uh, specifically for dry flies. This right here happens to be a Headwaters bamboo rod and their St. Joe 3-4 uh, reel um, and a, their silk line. It's a dream, it's a joy, it's uh, very affordable and um, it's just, it's, it's fun to fish something different once in a while and not always have to concern yourself all the time with catching 50 fish in outing, but rather casting a beautiful dry fly, getting a great drift, and then catching a fish on a piece of uh, replicated, or replicated bam, uh, 
fly fishing history. Hopefully you liked this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel. Check out the other videos in the playlist. Check out our awesome apparel, hats, everything else will be links below. Awesome designs, always dropping new stuff every week, especially this fall. We've got some awesome new designs coming. And uh, until next time, guys, catch you guys on the flip side in tight lines.